Hey everybody, I'm going to do something a little different today and talk about something I've seen a few eBay resellers do. I didn't do it to the extent that they do because I just haven't done it. I've thought about it to see what I could find, but what I'm talking about is dumpster diving. Now, the way I did it, I live in an apartment. We have a central place to throw our trash away. They don't come to the door. And I took my trash away, and there's some stuff and boxes sitting in front of it. At first, I just wanted the boxes. There was a couple of priority mailboxes, bigger ones that I've never seen before this size. So, but I started grabbing everything, and it was empty. I noticed one of them had some in it, so I emptied it into the bigger box that was kind of torn. And there it was. Surprise. Things to sell on eBay. Things that I really can't believe people threw away. Now, I haven't looked through anything yet. The cases could be empty. I know I haven't told you what it is yet. But let me get it out of my truck. It's still in my truck. And we'll discuss it. Okay, so I got it all over here. Now, I just noticed one of the priority mailboxes that I didn't, wasn't sure about is a large mailing box. Let me flip the phone around. Now, I have some of these, and I have a question if anybody knows. Large mailing box. It does not say large flat rate box. <clears throat> like this so my question is is this a flat rate box or is this a by weight box I guess I need to ask the post office that if y'all can't answer and like I said I stopped for the boxes I got a really got a semi big box and then This one, you know, interesting box. Who knows what I can use it for. And this one, uh, 12 by 11 by 8. And one of the things, I'm not going to show you yet, because I don't want you to see it yet. And I've already cheated. I've already looked at one of them and everything ain't what I thought it was. But yeah, there's that. There's those. Okay. This is the stuff I found. You see? Large flat rate box. See? That one don't say flat rate. It just says large mailing box. I don't know if that's the same or not. But here's what I found in it. Uh, wow, well, Nightmare on Elm Street. Anyway, Chrysler book. Somebody might want that. Bunch of uh, red box stuff was in here. Yeah, here's what I, other than the red box, you know, DVD, I don't even know if there's anything in it, but I opened up one of these a minute ago and it didn't have the disc in it, so, but I have sold cases before, you know, someone could need the case. There is one game. That one don't. That's the one I looked at. I know it don't have the game in it. Um. Yeah, Battlefield One for what's that? The Xbox 360. No, I missed the Xbox One too. I don't have an Xbox One. I have the 360, a PS2 and three. In a Nintendo Wii. 
but let's see. Okay, no CD. Let's see all these. Oh, there's the disc. What's this? I do not know what that is. But a bunch of red box. Oh, what? One, two, four, five, six, seven red box stuff. Yep. Eight. And then there's another case. has Mean Girls in it. I've got a bunch of DVDs with no cases, so I'll probably sell that with that. Oh, there's Mean Girls. And Clueless. And Wrinkle in Time. Hmm. That's a red box disc, I think. I hope I'm showing y'all this clear enough, because I just noticed I wasn't. But, uh, you know, another box. Yay me. Like... I don't have enough priority boxes already. So. I don't even care if Breaking Dawn is in there. It is though. You know this Chrysler book. You know people car collectors. They may want this. So that might be good. So. It wasn't as good of a find. And probably. Not as great of a video as I thought it'd be, but that's free inventory. You can find better inventory. I've seen people on dumpster dive videos find brand new shoes still in the box. So it can be done. Um, you always have to beware because. I think security can run you off, even though the dumpster is public domain once they throw it away. You're still on private property. I don't know how that works. I've never seen anybody get caught dumpster diving. Um, but I've seen people pull some real decent stuff out of a dumpster and resell it. And yes, it still looks good, and I can't tell you how it smells. But... Um, <clears throat> it's just one of those things I say if you feel like it give it a try I would around here but I kind of want someone to go with me and my wife's not interested in helping so I'm going to leave y'all with that today um, I appreciate it I don't know what day I'm going to release this video but it's 70 degrees outside today, and my mood's a little happier because of that. That's why I didn't release a video last week. So, I will talk to y'all. I know, I keep looking over. I don't know why. There's nothing over there but my truck. See, let me tell you. See, there's my truck. So, anyway, y'all be good. Like, subscribe if you like any kind of ebay content because i do anything from what sold to look what i got to sometimes i may even throw questions and points up here about what ebay is doing right or wrong um there are people that do that constantly like rockstar flipper if you want to know the business end of flipping he is a good one to watch if you ask my opinion of course, everybody knows Rally Roots and Harry Tornado, Josh and Ryan and Allie. Oh, and Haley. Sorry, Haley, if you watch this video. But, yeah, um, like, subscribe if you could. I'd really appreciate it. Um, subscribe more than like. Um, I do like the likes. I like like. I like Mike. I like Ike. Uh, those old buttons back in the day. But anyway, y'all have a good one.